this is a problem that you're almost guaranteed to see at some point in your studies on standardized tests. This is an important problem. What they're asking on number eight is what change will take place in the area of the triangle if the length of the base is doubled and the height is doubled. So let's call this, for sake of argument, we'll call this three, and we'll call this uh, six. The area for a triangle is equal to A equals one half the base times the height. Here we have base times height. We have if B equals three, and H equals six, we have the area equals one-half six times three, eighteen. And one-half of eighteen equals nine. So that's the, just the case of the base triangle. Let's double these sides and see what happens. This is what they, what they want us to do. Double this, double this. Make this six and we'll make this 12. And what's going to happen here is we're going to have the base now equals to 6, equal to 6, and the h, the height, is equal to 12 now. I use a different color here. The base here is 6, and the height is now 12. Now the area equals 1 half. 6 times 12 is 72. That would equal 36. And as you can see, the scale of these two numbers 9 times 4 equals 36. So what's happened by doubling the size of our sides? We end up increasing the area by 4.